are really just trying to, without getting too wedded to any specific tool because the tools change so much, we're really trying to um, find ways to tell good stories, to make those stories, make the best use of, use of the medium. Um, so be multimedia stories, a lot of youth created stories, a lot of finding and telling stories about what's, what's happening and what's working and sharing those um, in a way that, that brings people together and energizes people and can help ultimately make connections and help people um, get mobilized to take action and to, to work together across. So I think what's important to understand about social media is that it is simply a lens on a great story. And so if you don't have a great story to tell, social media will make life very difficult for you. The number one piece of advice I can offer is to listen first. Um, this is something that, that we have spent a lot of time doing and I think we're pretty good at it. Um, we listen in all of the spaces that we go into before we jump into the conversation or start um, spatting out our expertise on certain issues. Um, and that's really because when you go into a new area, people don't know who you are, they're not familiar with you, and if you just jump into the conversation, it's, it's kind of rude and it's kind of unexpected and, and you want to know what people are saying about you anyway first um, so you can figure out how to respond, what to say, um, and to really not be intrusive but come in and add value to the conversation. But my number one most uh, useful best practice is just to be a good listener and, and certainly I love that word empathy and you know we all work in these sorts of nonprofit organizations because of it's a labor of love and it's uh, we're trying to help people and 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 network weaving is just an extension of, of doing that so it, the first step always is to listen and to find out what your constituents and the people that you're trying to uh, whose groups you're trying to be a part of want from you and what value you can possibly provide in in those spaces whether they're huge big spaces or tiny little niche well, spaces. The tactics that I would recommend would be to listen. Whenever you jo first join a community, just pay attention to who's doing the talking, who's listening, and what the priorities are of that community. And then you can really start to understand the people within it and who the current leaders are.